Thank you for hanging out with me today. This is KJ4 e and welcome back to the front. So, man, it has been an incredibly, um, an incredibly crazy in between videos. Okay, first of all, I died on the manual miner. I left my guy in the manual miner overnight and he died of thirst. I didn't know that was possible. So that's something I'm going to have to be a little bit, you know, I'm going to have to keep an eye on that. I'm still going to mine overnight. I think what I'll do is I'll turn off, drop everything on death. Because what happened was when I when I came in, I couldn't respawn. I had to, I had to shut down the game. And then I, when I came in, I was dead and my bag was nowhere to be found. So I went ahead and spawned all the stuff in because I don't feel like I should have lost that stuff. So I spawned it all back in. Um, not all of it, but most of it, all the important things. And from now on, whenever I'm auto, whenever I'm manual mining during the night, uh, I'm going to put like, you know, don't drop anything on death. So that way I don't mind dying. It's just, you know, I don't think it was fair for me not to have a chance to get my bag back. And let's see what we got coming in. Oh, hold on. I'm like, I gotta be careful. Oh, you know what? They might not be coming in at all. Yep, this has been a problem. So what they're doing is they're just attacking uh, my stairs for some reason. Uh, I don't know why they're they're doing it now. They didn't do it before. So I'm not really sure why they're doing it now. Uh, yesterday, nobody attacked my stairs. Today, people are attacking my stairs. So we're going to have to kind of adjust for that. I actually um brought in like a couple level ones just to kind of test out the base. I was having um, some issues with the base. This is one of them. And uh, I was having more issues too. And honestly, we'll get into that in a moment. Oh, yeah, I'm not really sure what the deal is here. I don't have any stairs on me, so. Go, stab, 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 stab. Yeah, um, I'm not really sure what the deal is here. I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to just put stairs. I'm going to knock out this entire wall and just make this whole area nothing but stairs. Hopefully that'll help. It's like, if they're not going to use the stairs, then okay, I get that. Maybe there's something going on with the pathing. The thing that's really strange is they used the stairs perfectly last episode. So it's just strange for them to, like, have this issue out of nowhere after having a whole, you know, three hordes with no issues at all. I'm not really sure. Let's see. I'm going to use the pistol a little bit. Come on, guys. We don't have all day. Time left, 220. Let's go. There you go. Clack, clack. Got you now. There you go, puppers. Oh, also with the bags. Um, the bags don't disappear. What happens is if there's a couple bags that, like, if people die right next to each other, what'll happen is the bags combine, which is a really, really cool game mechanic. I really love that. Okay, so none of them are making up the stairs. It might be the angle they're coming in on the stairs, too. Another thing I'd like to do today is upgrade the, the beacon here so we can build. I want to put that. Like, right in front of the stairs, you know what I mean? Well, I guess they will be in front of the stairs when all said and done. Oh, crap. Alright, heavy chopper. Um, come on. Go. Alright, let's go shoddy. There we go. I don't think I've fought a heavy chopper before. Oh, reload. Reload again. We're almost done. Oh, reload again. What the hell? There we go. All right, victory. How much damage does this thing take? Oh, it, I think it's getting auto-repaired, so... All right, let's see what we got here. Look at that. That's what I'm talking about. Cool. All right, move all that stuff in here. And let's go get our reward, store everything, and then we're going to, you know, c continue working on this base. I'm going to have to go back home and, um, you know, maybe I should bring a stone. I, I might bring this sto a stone table out here. You know, I probably could even make this my main base, honestly. All right, fair enough. Let's go right here. And do we have enough room for stuff? Not really. Let's put stuff away first. Sort. Go and that. That should be pretty good. Nope. Hold down that and retrieve supplies. Okay. 61 shards. Um, we got an iron sickle blueprint, which is cool. Um, oh, some polymer. I like that. Yeah, that's some good stuff. Cool. Now we got nine minutes before we can do another one. 
And here we are. Some people told me to use pillars and then stone floors to get over the fact that the elevation is dropping. So yeah, I'm, I'm gonna mess with that. I think I'm also gonna move here. I'm gonna move here. I don't, I don't know where I'm gonna build. Maybe I'll build on the river. I don't want my house to be where the horde base is, but I'm thinking I'm gonna build on the river. It's gonna take a while to move here, but um, it's something that I do plan on doing uh, relatively soon. I also did upgrade the um, the beacon thingy. I forget what it's called, the space-time beacon. Yeah, I upgraded the space-time beacon, so that will be pretty sweet. And what we're gonna do now is we are going to tear out some of these. And hopefully we can get these guys to come up on this first level uh, with a little less uh, resistance. I think that'd be pretty cool. We're gonna kind of see. There we go. And I'll leave that one like it is, I guess. All right, I do have a lot of stairs. All right. So where are they? There they are. All right. See. Okay. There. Wait. I don't know why I can't put it there. Overlaps. Oh, with the creature lore. Okay. All right, so we're gonna have to make another creature lore. Okay, fair enough. Yep, yep. Okay, so the creature lore is causing issues. The thing is, I can move it back now. Okay. Well, we have that. We have as many stairs down as we can get, and I will move that creature lore back. I'm gonna have to go home. I'm gonna have to like wait through the night, or maybe log out, or whatever, to get the night to be over with quicker. But when I come back, it will be the day, and we will have another creature lore. All right, let me show you what I got going on over here. Just gonna come around here and one more time. By the way, I was told not to put doors in here, so I won't be doing that. So this is what I got going on. I move this back. All right, we've got all these stairs. That trap right there will probably be useless at this point, but that's okay. That's okay. We're gonna go for the next big round. Oh, by the way, I can make a machine gun, but uh, also, which I'm going to, uh, I'm gonna make a machine gun as soon as we're done with this round. So what happens if I fail? Like, if they destroy my beacon, then I just gotta make another one and that's it? Or... Oh, okay, so really quickly, before I started recording, I had a problem where when I tried to call in a horde, it said that they didn't have the proper uh, pathway to get in, all right? So what I did was I moved this floor back a little bit. I put the stairs back to make sure there's plenty of room over here. Also, I read somewhere that having roof pieces over here will cause issues, so I took off the roof pieces. So yeah, we'll have to see how that we'll see if we'll have to see how that goes. All right, round five. Let's do it. I would like to put. Oh, and everyone's telling me these half walls. I don't know if I mentioned that already. I think I did. All right, so they are coming up. All right, cool. They're getting farther though. I don't think I'm gonna do tier six with this setup. I'll probably go for a better setup for tier six. Yeah, the stairs are working perfect now. Oh, so they're not getting one shot at anymore. That's the problem. Okay. Well, we're gonna get a big boy this time, so I'm, I'm a little bit nervous about that. We'll have to see how that goes. We're definitely getting more traps, man. There's a. Oh, here we go. Right. Go. Come on, tough guy. All right, got him. All right, hopefully that's the hardest thing that'll come in on this horde on this uh, round, but I'm not convinced. I have a feeling I'm gonna get a bigger, badder guy, and he's probably gonna get through. Yep, he'll definitely get through because that one got almost to the end. If I get a tougher guy, I'm gonna have to go down there and fight them. Faux show. Sure. Right. You guys are fine. Woof! I love this, man. This is awesome. It really is. All right, 30 more enemies. 30 more enemies. We're 40% through. All right, I'm not going to worry about those guys. Well, I'll shoot you. Or maybe I'll miss. There you go. Cool, cool. I'm going to get a big guy. It's going to be a problem. It's going to be a problem. I don't think this thing can hold up on... Uh... Yep, there we go. Oh, so he's just a regular big guy. There we go. All right, cool. I just gotta help, that's all. I wonder if I could put a floor piece going out this way and I could walk along the sides. That might be helpful. Please, nothing harder than that big guy. Please, nothing harder. Please, pretty please with sugar on top. This is awesome, by the way. This is so cool. I thought I couldn't like this game anymore. 
But I was wrong. I was wrong. Alright. Looking good. Looking good. Alright. Here we go. Here we go. They sound like they're still alive when they're dead. They, they, they growl for a while. Alright, here we go. Nope, the big guy? Okay. Cool. Yep, you guys are all toast. Even these smaller guys are getting farther than I would like. You know? I'm pretty sure this cannot handle round six. But I will be making upgrades, so it'll be fine. The stairs are working perfectly, by the way. That makes me very happy. Oh no, that's not what I wanted to see. That is not what I wanted to see. All right, got him. That's what I was worried about. Maybe this could handle the sixth uh, horde. That's what I was worried about right there. Oh, oh, hell yeah. Oh, hell's freaking yeah. That is some sick loot. And they reward you with the loot, man. This game does it right. This game does it right. So people are asking, why are there so many bad reviews on Steam? I don't know. I don't know. But, man, <laughs> I'm having a great time with it. Steam reviews aren't going to ruin my my uh, enjoyment of the game. That's for damn sure. Uh, I'm not going to have any room for that. Well, we'll loot what I can. Yes. Okay, so we need to go drop this stuff off. Wait, 20 minutes? Oh, man, seriously? Can I change that in the settings? You're probably not supposed to, though, because it's probably... It's probably balanced to be really powerful. And they balance it by making it take longer. Yeah, I guess... I guess making it quicker would not be a... Would, wouldn't be fair to the game. Uh, oh, corn does... Oh, corn does go bad. All right, I'm gonna have to... I want to do something with that corn. I guess I just eat it to get the seeds. Yeah, I'm gonna eat it to get the seeds. I think that's the only way to get seeds that I, I know of. Ooh, sweet wine? Hell is that? Spicy fish. It looks gross. I'm not eating that. I ain't eating that, bro. Sort, and let's take a look at... I, I put all my um my blueprints in here, by the way. Heat-resistant topware. Legendary blueprint. Wow. That looks good. Metal pants. Legendary. Concrete floor. I don't care about that, but the, the Trop SMG, that's a new gun I can make. Whoa, 81 freaking machine parts? Oh, my goodness. Actually, it's not too bad. It's only one copper and one iron, so... Um, leather pants, leather gloves, better sniper rifle, more leather stuff. Wow. Wow. All right, let's go Let's go get the rest of the loot. You know, 20, you know what? 20 minutes isn't bad. I, I need to beef up the base. I'll bet you I'm not done beefing up the base by the time that 20 minutes is done. So, probably doesn't matter. How, much, how many arrows did I use? I don't know. I don't remember how many I had. Yeah, that Iron Wolf guy was, you know, that's what I was worried about. All right, and you. And you. All right, now let's go get the big loot. Should we get for this? Um, I, What's the best way to get skill books? Do I have to go out and, like, kill people out in the world for skill books? Is that the way it goes? Because I don't get skill books for this. <clears throat> 76, some oil... Some machine parts. Uh, ooh, a legendary double-barreled shotgun. Hell yeah. Well, blueprint. Awesome. Well, let's see what kind of tech we have here to unlock. Uh, graphite. Yep. Definitely going to want to be something I need. I don't know about glass bottles. I don't use Maltovs, but I guess I could. I'll probably unlock that later, though. Uh, there's some more stuff I want to unlock here. Uh, the Trop SMG. Um, binoculars? I don't know what's beyond binoculars. I guess I might as well knock it. Uh, flashlight. Binoculars. And... Maltovs. Grenades. Maltovs. Mods. Come on. Mods. I gotta look into the mods. Okay, how much do we have? How many do we have left? 583 left. Okay, structures. Um, uh, can't make concrete. Oh, here we go. This is something I definitely want to look into. Crude mine shaft. Definitely have to look into that. Vehicles. We haven't done anything with vehicles yet. Um, 
I'm gonna go with storage. I might do vehicles today too. Just unlock everything. Gear. Uh, nothing in gear. There's just um, some some padding, some shoe padding. Uh, supplies. Uh, do I care about medical stuff? Sure. Uh, what is that? Oh, a fermenter? Okay. Fruit pie. And tech. Here we go. The guillotine trap. Um, oh, here we go. Flintlock trap. And then we have... What is this? Circuit breakers, splitters, couplers, refrigerator. Here it is. Um, heater. Oh, heater. Okay. Hydraulic stuff. Okay. I want this right here. Auto guns. Automatic turrets. That's what I really want. But I can't do it until I hit level 30, so... Okay, cool. Just unlocked a, a crap ton of tech. There's a lot of things I'd like to craft today, but it all starts with building a base. Um, you know, I'm getting tired of going back and forth between this and the other base. <clears throat> so I gotta make something here. And this is what I got so far. Uh, let's just go ahead and do that and that. Nope. Wait, overlapping? Cannot place because it's too high or... No, really. Um, overlaps with instance foliage. Is there... That's weird. Maybe it's this. It might be this. Let me just go ahead and dig this up. See if this is the problem. I'm still learning the, uh, you know, the building aspects of the game. There we go. Come on. A little bit more. All right. Now let's try. Yep. That's what I thought. Can this come all the way across? No. Is that because it's too close to the other one? Let me check. You can't build over water either. At least I don't think you can. I'm going to try though. I'm going to try. Probably not today, but I don't know what kind of base I want to make. I think I have an idea of a basic base. So we'll see. See? Yep. Nope. It's too far. See, it's too far. Okay. So this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to put a pillar here. Oh, I can't even put a pillar there? Why not? Oh, it's because it's too close to the water. Okay. Well, how come this isn't too close to the water then? It's kind of odd. You cannot place anything there. Okay. All right. I guess you can't build over the water. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. I won't build over the water then. All right. So how big do I want this thing to be? So right now it's one, two, three, four. I think I want a three. Yeah. Three entrance. Okay. You know what? Why don't we just start building the entrance? Okay. So we're going to need a door. And I kind of like the door. I'm going to put it back that far. Or no. I don't, well, you know what? That might not be far enough back. Let's um, let's put down a few more foundations first. All right, so we'll put one there, there. Okay, so here's the thing, guys. I don't like the two by two foundations. I'm going to tell you why. They don't. The two by two foundations are so big. A lot of time you can't place them where you need them to be, and you have to fill them in with these foundations. The problem is they 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 look this. They, they, they let me try that again. The problem is they're different. They have different looks. I wouldn't mind if they look the same, but they don't. So I am not going to be working with the big foundations anymore. Okay, so doorway. I want it to be that far away or that far away? Am I going to want to put anything else outside? You know what? I kind of like it like that. Okay. And then window. Um, here. And then window here. All right. And then we're going to put full walls. Uh, full wall, full wall, full wall, damn it. Oh, I could change it though. Hold on. How do I do that again? F, switch it. Cool. I love that feature, man. That is a great feature. There and there. All right. So that's the basic idea of the entrance way. Okay. And I do have some of the stairs on me. Now, there's all different kinds of stairs you can do, but I think those are the, this is the best for coming in out of the, you know, outside. So, I guess just right there in the middle? Or we could put on the sides. Yeah, let's put on the sides. I don't, I don't know about the middle. And then I think you could put a railing up there. I'm just not sure how. It would have to be a wall, right, for a railing? Is this the only railing, the half walls? I'm not sure. I'll just put a half wall there for now if there's other kinds of railings. 
you know, let me know. Okay, so that's all looking pretty good. So then we got to come out. Um, how many more spots? Two more, I think. Two more on that side. We got to be even. So two more on this side. Actually, you know what? I got a better idea. We're not going to come out two. We're going to we're going to come out two on this side, but we're not going to go any farther. That will be the way upstairs. I think that'll be pretty cool. So we're going to need some walls here. So we're out of foundations now, which is fine. Um, that'll be a wall, a wall, come on, wall, wall, and let's see how we do the stairs. I haven't messed around stairs yet. Um, I mean, it seems pretty simple to me, right? I mean, that, that looks good, right? Yes, actually it does. And then we're going to do is we're going to take this out. Okay. And we are going to turn that into a window. And then this will be a window. And this will be a wall. Wall. I went ahead and made a few more defensive items. And I also made this little entrance here that I hope will keep me safe and allow me to get into the base from this way without the enemies trying to get in from this way. We'll have to see about that. Um, I also made a... What did I make? Oh, yeah. I made a springboard trap and I made two ballista, two ballistas traps thingies. So we're going to put the ballista. I'm not really sure where I should put the ballistas. I guess maybe like one right here in this corner. I don't even know what you can put them on. Um, okay, so you need to put it on something. Okay, fair enough. What I'm going to do is I think I have some floor pieces over here. We're going to put some floor pieces on there and see what we can do. Um, stone floor pieces. I also have a lot of stuff on me. I'd like to get rid of some things. Uh, there we go. Get rid of that just to make some room. There we go. That'll be good enough for now. Get some of these ballistas down. I think they work with stone arrows, they said. Hopefully. Because that's what I can make. And let's go ahead and put down... A sort. There we go. Yes, we can put them on the outside. Oh, that's beautiful. Hopefully it doesn't screw with the pathing in any way. We'll just kind of see about that. And uh, let's go ahead and put one of these down right here. Is that a pretty good spot for it? I don't know. Maybe... Yeah, you know what? Let's put one here. Um, I don't want it going over the edge. I guess it's supposed to. And then we can put one right here as well. It's weird. Like, it's not letting me put it down. Like, yeah, it's a little odd, but that's okay. All right. So what do they take? Show hide. Um, auto repairing. Yeah, I'm, I'm assuming they take... Well, I think they take bolts. But I don't know if there's actually bolts in the game. I don't know any crossbows or anything. So let's let them, uh, you know, build themselves up. And then we're going to put one of these little, like, traps here that will kind of throw a guy out, I guess. I don't know. not really sure what the point of that is. But it it'll be fun to, like, throw guys back. All right. Let's come in here. Let's go into our tech tree and ballista right there. All right. Heavy duty ballista that fires, uh, requires stone arrows. Okay. That's what I wanted to know. So we can take, um, we can take a few out of here. Oops, did I just take them all out? Yeah, okay. All right. Nope, 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 not, not right click. There you go. That's what I wanted to do. Okay, and then we'll do that again. All right, we'll see. See how good these are? I mean, I guess they're in a good spot. I don't know. I don't know anything about the base defense in this game. Just kind of, you know, winging it. There we go. All right. And we put these in here. And we put these in here. Let's go see if we have any more of these stone arrows lying around. Because um, I would like to have a few more. I could probably make them. Let's see what I need to make them. Uh, no, what am I missing? Stone. Oh, okay. I can make a few of those. Let's get some stone. And then we have some stone here somewhere. We also need some of this. And some of that. And some more of that. I'm going to have to go out and mine some more stone, but that is okay. Uh, 88? That seems like a lot. Let's make uh, 40. How does that sound? That sounds really good. All right. And then I'm also going to see if I have any in here. I thought I had some in here, but I probably put them in the, in the machine already. All right. We should be pretty good now. We've got 20 more arrows to divvy up. There we go. So 24 in that one. 
25 in that one. All right, let's. And you know what? I wasn't gonna do the next hardest um, horde, but you know what? The hell with it, man. We got some more defenses, so let's do it. Round six. Okay. Come through here, and there we go. Dude, I think the problem is these things are gonna use up all their ammo when I don't want them to. Can I make some more while I'm here? Uh, maybe. I'd have to go get more stone and wood. Yeah, let's get some more stone and wood because those things are going to go through their, their bolts very quickly. Alright, so stone and wood. Alright, and then... Uh, they seem pretty powerful. So I'm going to want as, as many arrows as I can get. Yeah, these things seem really devastating. Damn, that guy almost got through. The hell? Okay. That's a bit of a bummer. See how that goes? I mean, he was almost dead, so I guess it's not the end of the world, but damn. Like... Oh, so these things aren't one-shot. Yeah. Maybe these things aren't as powerful as I thought. <laughs> that guy got thrown back. Hey, right, you're done. 35 more enemies. I'm definitely going to get another uh, wolf guy or whatever they're called. Oops. Dude. All right, I'll hit him with the pistol a little bit. before Soften him up a little bit before they get here. Okay. I know that, like, that trap throwing them along isn't really doing anything, but it's more for the fun of it. And there we go. I don't think I'm hitting him. Yeah, I definitely wasn't hitting him. Yeah, these things don't do nearly as much damage as I thought. Which makes sense, because it is pretty early in the tech tree. Alright. Love the shotgun. I gotta make my legendary shotgun, too. Right, here we go. Oh, big guys. You alright? Yeah. Still making... Still making more arrows. Alright, we're gonna get a big guy now. Maybe not. Well, we'll get one now for sure, right? Right? No, no big guy in the last... There he is. Alright, cool. So we didn't get the uh, the Iron Wolf. Or what is it called? Iron Wolf? I think it's called Iron Wolf. We didn't get the Iron Wolf this time. That's kind of weird. Right? Alright, not that I'm complaining. It is just kind of weird. All right, let's get some loot. Oh, a striker. Oh, an auto shotgun. I didn't know auto shotguns were in the game. Can I make it even though I don't, I'm not, I don't have the tech? Oh, dude. We're going to be doing some major crafting next episode. I'm thinking next episode is going to be uh, building the base. And I'll probably, do, I'll probably build a lot of the base off camera. I'm going to show you what I've got so far. And it, it's a basic layout, so. There we go. Oh, my goodness. All right. Let's eat those bananas. There we go. Love me banana. And we've got a couple more things out here. Darn it. Okay. Let's go drop stuff off. Our, our loot in the base is in this like horde base is actually kind of um Yeah, it's kind of uh filled up. So we're not gonna have that much room, but I think I'll have enough room. Yeah. Yeah, look at this. Oh my goodness. Alright, I'm just gonna throw stuff up here. I'll organize off camera. There we go. I, I do want to give you a tour of my base as well, because I will probably do a decent amount of building off camera, and I want you to know the layout so you don't miss anything important. Okay. 
And I also have to start getting more of those mods that, that opens up more of my inventory. I didn't think it was going to be a problem, but it is. It's a good problem to have. Okay. And right here. And right here. And here. And let's go get the... Let's go get the reward. Those things are okay. They don't do a lot of damage, though. I'm assuming you're supposed to make a lot of them. Or maybe get, like, better turrets. They're, they're relatively cheap, though, so I could I could get more of them. And... 92, inorganic salt. Uh, nothing there. Oh, steel ingots. I can't make those yet. Purple shotgun. Love it. Flintlock pistol. Eh. And electronic parts. Okay, cool. Not too bad. Not too bad at all, guys. I do think I'm going to call this one here, though. If you ended up enjoying the video, please remember to uncage that like button. Also, if you're new here, please subscribe for more daily videos. Thank you very much for watching. I'll see you next time. And until then, take it easy. Mm -hmm.